Hello and welcome to the Reboot Speedrunning tutorial. This video is on the beginner route for level 11. The first thing we're going to do in this level is go straight forward and pick up the antivirus. If you already picked this up in level 8, you don't need to worry about it now, but this is a fast and easy place to get it. And then carry forward and to the right to the first vid window. After entering this vid window, immediately turn around, go behind the vid window and up these ramps. Each path in this level has a tear on the lower path and a key on the upper path. If you haven't already fully upgraded the blaster, there's another upgrade for it right here you can pick up. You'll see tears along, er, not tears, turrets along each path. Uh, just unload some blaster shots at them, you should be able to take care of them fairly easily. If you are already close to the key, when the tear spawns, just carry forward and get the key. That's not a big deal. You'll notice that the tear has spawned. It is right over there, but there is no timer up at the top. That is something that is, I believe, unique to this level. The tear timers do not start until you are on the path to the tear. So if you're going for a key on a path that is not the path that a tear just spawned on, you'll have all the time in the world to just keep going for it. Uh, you'll see when I jump over the tear here, then the timer starts, and you have only a little time to mend the tear. If you're not close to the key and that timer has started, go ahead and mend the tear. Focus on that. That's the important thing. There's a big enemy in the center of this level that's shooting rockets at you. You can basically just ignore it. You don't need to worry about that. Uh, going through this second window, I like to, as I enter, turn to the right and hold down and R1 to move into position for that ramp. Take out this turret, and then there's a life that's really easy to grab right here. Uh, the platforming for this second path is fairly difficult. I, I think this is the hardest of the three tear p er, key paths, I think. Ooh. So, be prepared to fail at many times. Uh, if you're not comfortable doing that jump around the corner I just did, it's not very hard to just stick to this, uh, this ramp in the corner here. After that, we will carry on to the third tear path. The window for it is behind the building here. This one, the uh, for the path, you need to go around this side of the vid window instead of the other one. Uh, again, it's pretty straightforward. Just jump over the platforms, shoot some blaster shots at the turrets. The jumps across these big fan mechanisms are fairly difficult to make. If you do fall, uh, the third path and only the third path actually has a nice skip you can do to get right up to the end. Uh, it's just a little strafe jump you have to do. It's a little difficult, um, but once you get the hang of it, I, I think it, it helps a lot. So yeah, hopefully you will have all of the keys by the time the third tear spawns. Before I mend the tear and finish the level, I'll mention another thing. Uh, you mostly don't need to worry about enemies in this level, but if your health does start getting low, there are a lot of health pickups, so it's good to know where they are. One of them is up here near where I picked up the third key. Uh, one of them is directly below me here where the first vid window is. And there's also a health pickup on each of the lower pads. So if you fall uh, and you're running low on health, it, it might be good to snag one of those. And then once you've mended all the tears, collected all the keys, feel free to 
carry on to the level exit. If you have any other questions, feel free to ask in the comments below or ask in the Discord.